knuckle curve to get him. So Dellen ends up striking out the side, picks up save number three. This is what he's done in 43 games since May 12th. An opponent average of just 120 and an ERA of 127. Let's hear from Dellen with the media and Meredith. Dellen, what allowed you to bear down and get through the rest of that ninth bases load and just one out? Uh, you know, you got to make pitches, obviously. Uh, you know, I know I, I, um, I have the chance to, you know, get a big strikeout with Span, and then, uh, you know, from there I got two outs, one out of way, and, you know, same same thing, just try to make pitches, and, uh, you know, obviously they're, they're a tough, tough lineup, and, you know, you got to be careful with some of their guys, so that's what I was trying to do. Romine said he never felt like that inning got out of hand. How did you remain calm and remain relaxed to make pitches in that situation? Well, I kind of put myself in, in, in a spot where, you know, with the first guy, I made a mistake with two strikes. And, uh, you know, obviously now I got a runner on and, you know, I, I got to be careful with Cano and, you know, Cruz. I was trying to expand with Cano, got him in the back foot. And with Cruz, he just he put a tough at bat. You know, obviously uh, he has a lot of home runs, so you don't want him to beat you there. And then, you know, once I got bases loaded, I just try to bear down and, you know, make pitches. I know I, I was a couple pitches from getting out of that. And the blood thing is kind of new to this season. Why? Why do you think that's happening? I know that the, your fingers kind of ripping against your. Did you change your grip? Uh, I haven't changed my grip. Honestly, I don't know. It's weird. You know, it's just been an ongoing thing this season, and uh, you know, it's annoying. The index. Uh, I mean, the ring finger. Sorry, ring finger. Anything you can do to try to. I mean, we've been trying to do the best we can. It's just so raw right now that any time, like, I could just tap it and it starts bleeding. So, you know, that's that's the problem, you know. I mean, uh, you know, we're we going to try to continue to you get, it, we get it better. and uh, But it's just uh, tender right now, I guess. Have you been able to heal it at all this season, or has it just been consistent? Yeah, uh, I was good for about three weeks, and then I got myself pretty good. I think it was probably three or four games ago. And now it's really, I've been getting myself every game. So it's just a matter of hopefully, uh, you know, uh, land that heel. But I, I don't know what I, you know, I've been trying to do a lot of stuff, but it's just one of those annoying things. Does it really start in the bullpen or just in the games themselves? It's uh, in the games. You know, it's been in the games. In the bullpen, I haven't really, you know, I don't know. I don't know if it's the intensity and while I'm pitching, maybe, you know, I'm ripping through some of those pitches and you know, I got big fingers, I guess, so, you know, but I just got to do the best I can and, you know, hopefully it heals faster than than uh, what it's been doing recently. Does it bother you when you're letting it go? Or it, it just bothers me when there's a lot of blood and, and the grip becomes uncomfortable, to be honest with you, but... You know, that, that's where it doesn't bother me holding the ball. It's just, you know, if there's a lot of blo uh, blood, uh, the ball kind of just doesn't stand still in my hand, and that's where, you know, it could affect uh, the way I throw my pitches, but that's it.